Hello everyone, this is Running On Empty Food Review. Hello, welcome, Domino's Review. I, I was, you know, I was kind of thinking how to set this one up and I, maybe you could notice compared to reviews past at this location, I'm kind of playing around with the lighting a little bit, testing some things out, and I decided I'm going to get creative here and I'm going to put these in a special formation. And that they are. Um, now I got some wings, I got some pizza too. You can see for uh, verification the pizza is there still uneaten. You know, getting cold, getting cold by the minute, but it's, you know, it's a worthy sacrifice. Poor little guy. We have the pizza here, that's just, that's just the meal. Um, but then we have the goods, as they say. Wings. You know, you might, and this isn't a new item by any any means at all. Uh, this has been on their menu for ages, but it's something that I came to the realization a couple days ago. I was looking through my old videos, and I found this review of Domino's that I did back in 2013. And in the review, I reviewed actually this exact same combination, their pizza and their wings. And I kind of watched the review that I did of the wings, and I thought, you know, it... It, it's not even really a review, you know, I kind of talked about the wings for 30 seconds, but I didn't, and I really didn't do anything. I was mostly just, uh, not really taking it seriously. So I thought, you know what, I gotta redeem myself here, because it was just, it was just eating at me. You know, I couldn't sleep at night, I was thinking about those wings, I was just saying, you know, I gotta do something about this. And now I am. I'm kind of, you wouldn't say re-reviewing them, I'm just actually, uh, reviewing them, so... We got the wings here. I guess we can move the pizza, right? We got the pizza here. That kind of was taking center stage, but now we'll give the wings their time. Ugh, pizza boxes are always so fun to work with here. There we go. All right, we'll, we'll move this, this guy. I'll put him here. Now the wings, okay. These are just their standard wings, bone in. You can get them in a variety of flavors, but I got them in the classic buffalo. Okay. We'll move it in this way this time. This is a rare angle. You can see there's the wings. I got an eight piece. So that's actually two groups of four. Two groups of four wings. You could kind of see them. I hope. Now you really can see the wings. Um, but, you know, there's the wings. You can see there's eight wings. Again, bone in. You get both types. You get the little um, little drumstick, little drumstick wings right here, and then you get these. I call them the flappers. And you get some of those too. They seem fairly saucy. You could also get it with a side of your choice, uh, any sort of sauce. And usually people get it with ranch, blue cheese. I said I'm gonna kick it up a notch and get their famous uh, kicker sauce. And, uh, that's what I have. Not even going to try the sauce just yet. Build that suspense and anticipation. So what I figure we'll do, you know, it's just going to be a quick review. Um, pretty much I'm just going to, yeah. I'm just going to try some wings. Um, maybe try like two wings or so. And, uh, I'll just let you know what they taste like. So it's the wings, buffalo wings, hot wings, whatever you want to call them. Just the wings. The ubiquitous wings uh, from Domino's going in. Everyone complains about how I eat the wings, but you could eat them however you'd like to, you know. No one's telling you otherwise. So I just eat them in standard review bra style.
you know? I wonder if there's sauce all over me. Well, if there is, I apologize. Kind of matching the tie with the sauce, though, you know? You know, it's interesting. I don't get Domino's all the time. You know, I, I really don't. I, I still utilize it here and there because of their delivery and their hours. Whenever I get Domino's, and this has been at least for the last year and a half, I almost, I never get the wings. You know, I, I just don't. I usually get, I used to get the breadsticks, then I got rid of those. Or the cheesy bread. Never really got the wings at all. And there's a reason why. I always used to think of their wings as low low quality, you know, subpar. I would always say they're not really sauced up at all. They're not, you know, getting lost in the sauce. They're not coated in sauce at all, at least from prior experience. Usually the meat is just either slimy or it's too tough. And it was always just a disappointment. But, you know, I'll be honest, perhaps it's a case-by-case -case basis. But the wings that I'm having right here, I mean... You know, it kind of makes me want to start getting them again, honestly. I mean, I, I gotta say, maybe they changed them up. I don't know. Maybe they changed the recipe a little bit. Maybe they improved the quality. Maybe this is just a stroke of luck. I don't know. But these are actually pretty good. I mean, I gotta say, the meat was extremely tender. I mean, you could see on this one, for instance, right? Just fell off the bone, you know? Just fell completely off the bone. Um, the meat itself, I really give them credit to. I mean, it's something I thought was going to be likely disgusting. It was actually really tender and pretty flavorful, too. I mean, it, you see, yeah, it just slid right off the bone. It's awesome. Uh, it's something I wasn't expecting at all. So it's a very, you know, unexpected positive change here. And I thought, you know, it's, it's actually nice to see. Uh, another thing that I liked was the sauce. Um, you can see they're actually finally covered and coated in the sauce for once. So that's another actually pretty good change. I'm, I'm, I'm really genuinely surprised by this. I wasn't expecting them to be this good, truth be told, but it's a, you know, it's a good surprise. It's a pleasant surprise. Uh, the sauce actually blends well too. It's not overwhelmingly spicy. They call them, they call them hot wings, but they're not actually hot at all. You know, it's more of a flavorful type of buffalo sauce where it has a little bit of spice, more like a mild spice to it. Um, but then it has this more, it really boosts the flavor of the wings themselves. It's not something that you're going to be uh, essentially dying over or anything like that. So, you know, you could get a little glass or, you know, receptacle of, of water in your possession. But I don't think it's absolutely essential for these. This is more of just a flavorful type of sauce. Otherwise, you know, I really don't have much to say about these. I mean, they're just your standard wings, but... You know, having a history, you know, consumption history of these wings from Domino's in the past and having them just been getting lower and lower and lower in quality, to have them actually being pretty good, uh, it's, you know, it's an unexpected and, as I said, very uh, pleasant, positive change, in my opinion. Um, I don't know how well this is going to really go with the wings. I'll just try it quick. That's really it, though. I mean, they're not, you know... There's no twists and turns, you can say, with the uh, with the wings themselves. You know, they just, they were just, you know, they're your standard wings, but they're better than I had anticipated them to be. The good good quality of the meat, um, and the sauce itself is, is good, too. We'll just see if this adds an extra spicy boost or not. Yeah. You know, you, you don't really need any ranch or blue cheese to, to kind of cool any sort of flames because there won't really be any. So the kicker sauce, you know, adds a little bit of a punch. It, that's a more of kind of a peppery type of sauce. So it'll kind of alter the flavor of the wings a little bit, but it will give you some extra, extra punch to it or kick, I guess as the name implies. 
But otherwise, you know, again, I don't have a whole lot to say about these. I just think they're pretty good. The meat is good quality, they're flavorful, and the sauce, I think, does it, you know, really just boost that flavor, too. Uh, eight wings, around six bucks, standard price. Uh, that being said, all in all, really, I mean, I'm, I'm just pretty taken back by it. I'm, you know, as I said, I'm surprised, but I thought they did a great job on this. And uh, it's a side that I have neglected for a while, but I think I would recommend it. I mean, I would definitely say it's a buy. I would say go for it. And uh, maybe you've had a bad experience with the wings in the past, but truth be told, this kind of changed my mind on them. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm a bit more open to them now, truth be told. That being said, out of 10, I'm going to be rating the standard uh, buffalo or hot wings, I think they call them, the hot wings from Domino's. I'm going to be giving these a 9.2 out of 10. 9.2 out of 10 is the rating. I think they're pretty good, and uh, well, that's all that I have for you. Again, just a little short review, shortish review, I guess. That's all that I have for you, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, The Report of the Week. Today's review was for the Hot Wings from Domino's. Thank you, take care, we'll see you sometime later. And now to eat the pizza.